All right, guys, KB32 here. Check it out. So we're sitting over here in the Freedom Studios. And I uh, haven't done a video in a week, so I thought it was time to go ahead and jump out there and get something done. Before we get going, though, uh, later on, I'm going to be doing a review on this guy right here, the Primary Arms 1 to 10 <laughs> by 28. This is a 34 millimeter tube, second focal plane scope with the Griffin reticle in it. And, buddy, let me tell you something. The clarity is absolutely unreal. So we'll go ahead and get some pictures of that. So what is this video about? Uh, this is the video. It's basically what I want to talk about is the failure of our politicians. And, and it comes about in the wake of, I guess, Liz Cheney. And I'm not even calling her a rhino. She was in, in the, what I think is the problem with the majority of the politicians these days. Well, they forget about what their job is to do. And that is to represent the people. And I think it's all safe to say that uh, the majority of the folks in Wyoming had no, <laughs> the, priority, the priority in their lives were not around the, uh, the January 6th hearings or the bullshit sham thing that they're doing without any cross-examination. Yet she was intent, uh, her mission in life was to lead a battle against uh, former President Trump. And that's the problem, ladies and gentlemen is that these politicians, they forget who they work for and why they are there in the first place. And that is to represent you, me, and everyone that their constituents in that area. So <laughs> what happens is a politician like Wetterford or whatever his name is, this guy that's uh, running up here uh, for Senate, uh, the Senate seat in, against Dr. Oz, I guess, he comes across as, I'm a person of the people. I do this and I do that. No. He's a left-wing, liberal, communist pig. Uh, ask him where he stands on gun rights or anything else. And he, I'll be honest with you, it's a disgusting thing because he does a great job at doing a commercial and selling what he's trying to pitch. So my thing is this. Politicians are self-serving. They don't serve the people. If you find a couple, there may be a couple of them out there that are actually there to represent the people that they uh put them in office. But Liz Cheney, according to, uh, what's his name from last night on Fox News, is worth $44 million. And she amassed that in a period of six years. I mean, she's, uh, how in the world, or how do you suppose this person came about that kind of money in a period of six years? It's like Nancy Pelosi. But don't kid, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, these politicians, they're not here to serve you, the people. They are here to serve the common goal and task of turning this country into a communistic, socialistic environment. We've totally lost control of this country. And if you think I'm wrong, please let me know down below if we're heading in the right direction, which I don't think we are. A uh, huge spending bill that has nothing to do with our, uh, what do you call it, uh, the inflation, cutting down the inflation. Uh, they're going to tax the shit out of everybody. <laughs> what in the wild, wild world of sports does the IRS uh, need $700,000 in ammunition? I I'm not exactly sure. There's the heavy rain. <coughs> but close to 90,000 new agents for the IRS. It's, it's kind of disgusting. So you think you're going to have a lot of bored a IRS agents out here because, well, you know, there's not that many people in this country that make $400,000 or more. So, well, they're bored and they got to go justify their job. So they're going to come after you. They're going to come after me. So get yourself a good accountant. Make sure you keep good records. And make sure you're not trying to write off anything that they would construe, construe as being uh, not worthy of a write-off. So anyway, that's my, that's my two cents right there. Uh, Politicians, they're self-serving, and they do what they're told by the great Nancy Pelosi. So hopefully uh, this November uh, we see a changing of the guard in both the House and the Senate. And uh, I would say that they need to go ahead and start impeaching every single buddy in this administration because this is the most dangerous administration I've ever in my lifetime, in my 53 young years, have ever seen. Unbelievable. Let me know what your thoughts are down below, guys. The problem with our politicians. It's KB32. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't done so. Support the red, support the red, white, and blue. God bless America. God bless his men, women in uniform. 
as long as they're not an IRS or <laughs> ATF agent, I guess, or anybody else. It's just not in thinking with our Constitution 24-7 for our freedom, because freedom sure as shit these days ain't free. It's KB32. I'm out of here. Y'all be good. Boom.